Hello everybody, Diane's Handsome Jack Boy here, bringing you guys the fourth episode of my Borderlands, the pre-sequel Legendary Weapons Guide. And in this episode, I'm going to be covering the Fatal. The Fatal is a Cryo Hyperion SMG, and the prefix for mine is Proactive Fatal. The prefix for you guys might change. Now, as you can see there in the red text, it says Stone Cold Killer. That means that the Fatal is always cryo, it has increased accuracy, magazine size, critical hit damage, and greatly increased recoil reduction. Now, in order to obtain the Fatal, the first thing you're going to want to do is to fast travel to Outlands Canyon. The boss that drops this thing, by the way, is known as Drongo Bones. He's going to be located right there on the map. Now, Drongo Bones is super duper close to the fast travel, so this guy should be really easy to farm. The only thing you really have to worry about is the scavs that spawn in the same area. They can be a little bit of an issue, but for the most part, you should be just fine. Now, in order to actually get Drongo Bones to spawn, you have to complete a side mission called Rough Love. You get this side mission from Nurse Nina in Concordia, but after that is when you'll be able to come over here and farm this guy. Now, I do believe I get the Fatal to drop around three attempts in. Yeah, I know, it didn't take me very long, and it shouldn't take you guys that long either, just because of how easy it is to get to this guy, and how very little time it takes to farm him. So, anyways, let's move on to the gameplay. Now, really quick, reading under the usage and description section, here on the wiki for the Fatal, it says, despite the stats listed on the item card, in sustained fire, the Fatal reaches its peak accuracy faster than most other Hyperion SMGs, even those of similar or higher levels. Its large magazine, high accuracy, and critical hit damage bonus make it an excellent choice for almost any combat situation, especially attaining a second wind. Its only real drawback is that it is weak against cryo-resistant enemies, which are particularly prevalent in true Vault Hunter mode or higher. Alright guys, so my opinion about the Fatal, this thing is actually pretty good, and one thing I really like about it is the accuracy. I mean, of course, it's crazy on this gun. Um, another thing I like is how it comes in cryo. It's a lot of fun freezing enemies in this game. Cryo is definitely one of my favorite elements, and the fact that this gun comes in cryo is awesome. Uh, another thing I do want to mention since I haven't bring this up yet, is if you guys didn't know, this is pretty much the bitch from Borderlands 2. It has the exact same special effect, it looks the exact same. The major difference is that this gun only comes in cryo, while in Borderlands 2, the bitch can come in any other elements, as well as no element at all. So, yeah, uh, that's, that's definitely one of the major differences between this gun and the bitch. But other than that, they're pretty much the same thing. So one of the reasons why I brought that up though is because if you think about it, it's it's kind of weird. Like, why doesn't this thing come in any other element besides Cryo? If it's pretty much the bitch from Borderlands 2, why isn't it like that? You know what I'm saying? What were they trying to do with this gun? Were they trying to make a completely different gun? Or, or what? I don't know, I just I just find it kind of interesting. Uh, but anyways, going back to telling you guys what I think about this thing. Um, as for the damage, it could be, it definitely could be better. At the same time, it's understandable since it only comes in cryo. The freeze chance is also pretty low, but the fire rate actually counterbalances that. So overall, freezing enemies is not that bad with this gun, but... Yeah, I mean, there's really not much else to talk about. Um, I really do love this thing, though. I do plan on using it a lot more. And, yeah, apart from that, though, guys, that's pretty much going to wrap it up for this video. I hope you enjoyed this. Be sure to rate, comment, and subscribe for more, and I'm out of here. Peace!